Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Don't make assumptions. Learn to ask questions. It is always better to ask questions than to make assumptions. Have the courage to ask questions until you're as clear as you can be. Once you hear the answer to the question, you won't have to make the assumption because you will know the truth. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 208, NASDAQ off 146, SP's down 41. Gold, gold contract down $23, trading at $16.32 an ounce. We have silver down 24 cents, $18.35 an ounce. Light sweet crude up $2.28. $85.10 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note, down 29 ticks, 110 flat. The 30 off a full point, plus 22 ticks at 122.28 and King Dollar. King Dollar's up 847 ticks, trading 112.976. The Euro's at 97. The Yen is trading at 149.89. And the British Pound is at 112 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. One that's going on in your world. In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, you get a pullback and you get a huge contraction of volume. So that's telling me that we're still going to go higher price, man. That's how it shakes out. You take a look at this. You, you know, you're down four bucks right now on the SPY. You get 56 million shares traded. Went higher yesterday with 97. Bigger yet, though, you're coming into the 147. Now, the 147 is 167.51. And what I'd like to see out here today is that the SPY closes over that. Because, you know, if, if it starts digging into that bar, you get a whole different flavor coming. But my take, you're pulling back, tremendously light of volume. That's saying that we still want higher price. NDX 100, same type of setup. What we, what we have in the three Qs right now, you have the three Qs. They're trading 41 million shares. Yesterday went higher with 69 million. You're going into 77 million as well as uh, 112 million. Now, the 112 million, that price, and we, I'd want to see this get a little bit higher coming into the close, the price, 270.17. And right now, we're at 269.58. We go to the uh, gold contract. What do you have with gold? Bottom line, gold. Gold's going lower. You have a contraction of volume, but the bottom line, price is not holding. And that's all about the dollar. Um, you have, you're going to see this, okay, we got 1.6 million, no, you got 100, 168,000, sorry about that, Go, and it going into 200, I believe, this, we came off the lows, yeah, 280, <sighs> the low, the low there is 1622, we hit 1632, and there's no reason it can't hit 1622, um, and it's, it's so close that you could get an ABC down, too. So we're going to have to really watch this coming into the close because it's down 168,000. If you do 183,000, guess what? You get an ABC down, and that would take you to blow out that low. Let me see, 1738. Yeah, it's almost a 90A to B. That would get you down into the uh, 1590 uh, area. Oh, well, I see. Interesting. Oh, huh. Yeah, that's not that bad, actually, because the low is 1622. Notes and bonds. We go take a look at that note and bond market. Bottom line, when you take a look at this, you know, that, that baby, you know, is going is on a one-way route. That's the real bottom line. Netflix, NFLX, okay, bottom line is that, you know, come out with the numbers, good numbers. Uh, Netflix, uh, to answer a couple of the questions out here, is in an ABC up. It's, it's a confirmed ABC structure up. You took out the B point, you took it out with volume, you pull this up, you're going to see it's a clean ABC. This is not only a clean ABC, what's really cool about this ABC is that it's an ABC after consolidation. So you get an ABC after consolidation, you really can get some juice going. Uh, the price projection on this is 294, and right now you're at 270. Let's pull this up back a little bit, and let me see what's at 294. And what's the top of that? No, it's not quite the top. It's got a lot of work to do, but hey, it's an ABC up to 294. That's that's a start. That's the real bottom. That's a start and in, in the aspect of uh, you know where we could see this baby going. Some of the high volume, e higher volume equities. There we go. 
in this market out here today. And it's going to be a low volume market out here today. We have um, Advanced Micro is down 87 cents. You got uh, NVIDIA flat four. Uh, where is Netflix? Netflix uh, we've never we've done Netflix. Bank of America is down a buck. You have uh, Transocean up 23 cents. United Airlines, that's up $2 as they're, you know, ripping us off left and right. Um, Comcast is down 24 cents. Inside the Dow Industrials, the strength versus the weakness inside the Dow Industrials. We take a look at that. And what you have point-wise is this. There you go. Point-wise is you have Travelers putting 42 positive points, uh, Chevron 39, Big Mac 10, taken away from it. Home Depot, minus 66. You got Amgen, minus 26. You get Goldman, minus uh, 23. Yeah, you know, and if you go over uh, and we take a look at Genrax getting smoked out here today, and that, what that's all about is that uh, the bottom line is that they uh, has way too much inventory, not even close, way too much inventory. Um, stock's down about 20%, and... Uh, they, I suspect they're going to they're gonna be going lower because uh, guess what? There's less houses being, being built. Um, I'm still buying Genrax, but after reading this article out here, it's going to be pretty cool because we're going to be doing some negotiations, that's for sure. Um, they, they're beautiful machines, by the way, folks, okay? The bottom line is that, you know, we, we use them, and pff, they, they're great. I mean, the bottom line, you hope that you don't have to use them, but when you do have to use them, you know, Bang, the switch goes on, you don't do a thing, whole house is lit up, air conditioning is going, heating's going, and, you know, they gas. So the bottom line is that, you know, they go in storms and they stay going for as long as you want. So pretty, pretty cool. And the, uh, the aspect of putting them in, well, particularly, we're putting them in new houses, so it's a lot easier than basically redoing a house. There's no doubt about that, between the switch and the electric panel. It's all about the switch and electric panel and we're putting them in. 877-927-6648, Dow. Dow Industrials down 141, NASDAQ off 115, S&P's off 30. Stay right there, come right back.